The AP obtained um, copies of the draft documents, the ones that were first drawn up, and uh, we looked at the new ones that were posted, and there are some differences. They've been pared down a little bit. There's a few things that have been um, removed, like, for example, um, for camps, for summer camps, there in the old draft documents, uh, one of the questions that was posed to the camp was, uh, if you're considering to reopen, uh, the question is, have you limited attendance uh, of campers and staff members to people who live in the area? If the answer is yes, then you could reopen. If the answer is no, you shouldn't. Well, that's gone. That's not that's not in, in there uh, anymore. That's not what's been posted. The other six that are up there right now are schools, uh, workplaces, camps, child care centers, mass transit systems, and the sixth category is bars and restaurants. There was a seventh, which was religious facilities, but um, that that's not, there is no decision tree for religious facilities. That's been controversial. We've learned from our reporting that um, there have been people in the Trump administration who have concerns about um, uh, presenting, presenting something to uh, religious organizations. It's a good entry document. It seems like the kind of thing you'd put uh, in the executive summary page and then maybe have three more pages or four more pages of, of things that uh, different organizations should consider and implement. Uh, we just have the one page so far.